Google launched the first Chromecast way back in 2013, and more than half a decade later, the device has become synonymous with streaming television in a way few expected. For just $35, the original Chromecast made it quick and easy to stream content from your phone, tablet, or laptop over your local Wi-Fi network. Since then, Google's Cast service has expanded to iOS, Nest's home speakers, and Google's own Android TV software, making casting a near-universal standard across all sorts of devices. However, Chromecast's simplicity is also its downfall in many cases, and that certainly extends to using a VPN with your streaming stick. Because most Chromecast devices only mirror content directly from your phone, there's no way to manually install a VPN on your device like you can with Amazon's Fire Stick. Instead, you'll have to find a workaround, and we've got a few of them to choose from. Let's start with the most straightforward method for using a VPN with your Chromecast. Upgrade your Chromecast to the newest model. This likely isn't the answer you want to hear, but it's certainly the method with the least amount of work. Google's newest Chromecast runs Google TV, a brand new operating system built on top of Android TV, and comes complete with a remote and support for Android apps. That means Google's newest Chromecast can easily install and run apps from VPNs like ExpressVPN, Surfshark, and IPVanish, among others. Just sign into the individual app and enable the VPN, and you'll be good to go. Okay, but let's say you aren't willing to buy a new Chromecast just to use a VPN. What you do from here is, unfortunately, a fairly vague concept, but basically, you'll need to look into whether your VPN supports routers, and specifically, whether it supports your router model. Let's use ExpressVPN as an example here, since it features out-of-the-box support for routers. ExpressVPN's website features a list of fully supported routers, as well as instructions for manually installing your VPN on certain brands. Once you have your router set up, you need to download firmware for your router from ExpressVPN's website, then install the firmware on your router. When you reconnect to the internet, your entire network will be covered by your VPN, as your traffic reroutes through your VPN's network. Obviously, this is a fairly vague concept, and you'll need to consult your specific VPN to figure out whether routers are supported by your network, and whether or not you'll need a specific router to begin with. Still, covering your network through a VPN is not just the easiest way to get an older Chromecast secured, it's the easiest way to secure every device on your home network at once. If you liked this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Chromecast and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.